YouTube, YouTube, what it do? It's your boy Chase back at again with another product review. You know what I'm saying? Today we're gonna review a company called Sheds. It's a lighting company. They reached out to me on email about doing a review on some lights. So let's get into it today. I'm about to do an unboxing too as well. It's been a minute, but we got some product today. So let's get into it, you know what I'm saying? So this is what we have so far. Fresh out the plastic. Okay, we have, turn it around for you guys. You got the speed con, power in, you got a fan, you got a mount for the mounts. Certificate qualification, you got the screen, the DMX screen. You got the, the DMX out, you got two fans on it. So, right now, I'm finna make these mounts, put these mounts on here, and we're gonna get to it. I'm gonna do both of them, and we're gonna get activated, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so it wasn't really too much directions on it, but I think I figured it out. I just watched the video. So, these is the mount. I guess the mount says like that, and the screws go on. I did both sides. So, just like that, tighten them up. You know what I'm saying? I'm looking at the menu, uh, manual right there. The manual is basically just showing you like the DMX addresses and the colors and the codes. But this is pretty much what we're looking at right now. So, please keep lighting, drawing in statements. So this is the 18 by 18 RGBW. Yeah, I thought it was a uh, UV2, but I guess it's just RGBW. But yeah, let's get to it. Another thing, the, the power cable is, hmm. Is this your connection? Hold on. I don't know if this is gonna work. Yeah, uh oh, this is the Euro cable, I guess. Overseas cable. I'm not really sure, but let's check it out and see what else what else they have in the box. I might have to get an adapter, but I'm not trying to do that. But let's see. Hmm, wasn't expecting that. Wasn't expecting that. But we got uh, DMX right here. I don't see any other power, just power con. But you know what? I think I have that, so I think we're good. this review uh, the cables that were sent if you're gonna buy these lights I need you to check and make sure you put the right country because they sent me I think the Europe connections so it's two prong that's what took me so long to do the review but I went to Amazon I'm not sure what company this is but I got one of these travel adapters so basically it's a, uh, a prom American American plug this for the European connection. You know what I'm saying? Um you just put it in like that. Snap in. So now you got the American connection adapter with the Europe connection to speak kind. So they sent me the Europe connections. I just went to Amazon and got it for like ten dollars, four dollars. I can put it in the description. And they sent me a DMX cable to jump from the other one. That's smart. Yup. All right. So basically, what we got today is the user manual. This is the LED wall wash 18 by 18 RGBW lighting. So this is pretty much the step, the rundowns, the codes. 
So four display control instructions. It's basically how to run these lights. They got the DMX address, the color, the color modes, all the summaries, all the breakdowns. Yeah, let's get to it, man. Let's try it out. Let's test it. So yeah, we're gonna put the adapter in with the plug. We're just gonna plug it in. And we're using Speedcon. That's what we're doing. This is the menu, 29 channels. I guess it's the color right there. Oh, that's the fades. I'm gonna tighten it up a little bit. But yeah, this is this is what we got. We got the fades right now. I guess it's like demo mode, fade to white. Let me cut the light off. Yeah, so I guess this is the fade modes right here. You get an idea of the colors. Let me turn down the ISO. There we go. So you get a better idea of what it looks like. I'm gonna give a demo at the end of the video. But this is pretty much what it is. I'm gonna hook, I'm gonna connect the other one in a minute. So you can get a better idea. Real real bright, real bright. Okay, so I'm running sound switch right now and I finally linked up this the sheds uh the wall washes. I finally got it linked up. So I can show you guys on another video how to do it, but it wasn't hard. I got it on DMX channel four. Got it synced in with my uh my board, you know what I'm saying? Control the colors like that. Blue, purple, green, white. Well, not white, but you know, that's white. Ooh, that's super bright. Uh, yellow, uh, yeah, that's yellow, my bad. Gold, blue, red. I need to learn how to do the phases, but they're just a preview of it, you know what I'm saying? The wall washes. Get a better angle of it right there. So I got the little pulses going right now. Let me do it, change it for you. There we go. Uh, let's try the. Let's try the scroll. Oh, that scroll is fire. Yeah, that's the scroll right there. Okay, we're gonna start with the uh, the loud noise is the fans. There's two fans on the back of the light. So this is the DMS control, it's 29 channels. CC, the color changing. So I guess it's like a fade mode. You got the greens, you got the blue, you got white. You got amber. And you got the UV. So that's a different modes on there. It's yellow right there for sure. White. Okay, let's go to the next. So it's like your pulse color changer. E28. Let's see what else we got. All right, next mode. This is like a bunch of colors fading. A bunch of colors fading. Yeah, I did, I love it. I've been trying to figure it out. Oh yeah, so 
pretty much like a chase. Okay, next mode. It's like a slower mode, slower a slower pulse. And that's like a slow chase. I like that fade right there. Okay. Yeah, it's a bunch of little modes. I'm still learning how to use it, but it's a bunch of modes. It's like the standard, like I guess the red, you just it takes a while to do it, but it's a bunch of modes and then you can get used to. Uh today we did a review on the LED wall Y611 RGB WA UV lighting bar. It's perfect for weddings and other events indoor use. Um, I'm a link. I'm a link the description of the product. But pretty much, if you uh, pretty much, it's 98 centimeters long, uh, 8.8 .8 centimeters high, 8.2 sideways. The total weight is 4.2 kilograms. Uh, it's AC 90, 275 volt power supply. Power consumption is 324 watts. Uh, you can pull up these specs. I'm gonna uh, link the description. But I'm just reading them right now. The fans are kind of loud. Uh, it's, it's a total of four fans, two on each light. But we have the colors of white, red, green, blue, mix, violet, and amber. Um, the main thing you need to do is probably learn the, uh, the features on the light, like the different phases and the different menus and the different categories they have. It's a lot. I'm still trying to learn it. This is a week later from the unboxing. I'm just following up, but I feel like it's a good product, but I'm gonna do a more uh, in-depth once I do it at a gig. I had trouble trying to figure out the standard colors like Chave and ADJ. They have like different modes. You can just do like red, green, blue, just to constantly light. But this right here is kind of like a a custom light like you got to edit the lights yourself you know what I'm saying but if you're using DMX it'll work but other than that man it's gonna conclude the video so we just did a review on the sheds party light party more light so that being said man like comment subscribe more videos on the way more unboxing reviews and more product reviews but thank you for tuning in until next time over out